More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the... Here we go, first round, you ready? You ready? All right, the wait is over. We are underway here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. That one hurt. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Beautiful inside leg kick. That shot is blocked by Faber. Straight right hand now just misses. They're going after it quick here. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Oh, now he has found his timing. He is doling out punishment here. It appears a cut has opened up on his cheek. Faber gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Both men landing in that exchange. Nice knee to the body. He's doing a very good job of parrying and blocking all the shots that are coming towards his head. Midway through round one. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. Effective with the jab. And there's a single attempt. Oh, there's the single. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Look at this reversal. T City gets caught by the inside leg. Pretty good jab there by Faber. Nice one, two there. Faber gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Using the hand. He got hurt bad. He's teeing off with some vicious shots. Wow! That's a big hook. Excellent movement here on the ground. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Elbowed him in the face. Oh, doubling up on the elbow. Flush. Elbows landing now. Oh, he lands a elbow. huge elbow to the head. Back to the guard position. So under 30 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Control, postures up, horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, so there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he registered two big knockdowns. Huge round from Faber. Two huge knockdowns. Very, very dominant round. All right, second round underway. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Uriah Faber is an elite, world-class mixed martial arts fighter and has been for a long time. He is amongst the very best in the world with very solid submission skills and relentless cardio and pressure. Nice kick there by Faber, and he lands a knee. Right hand forward now, switching to southpaw. Total strikes. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Trying to get a single. Back to the leg kick now, that one's no good. Faber gets caught with that punch. Oh man, that cut is nasty. Well, without much resistance, he continues to find a home for that jab, much like he did in the previous round. Here's a single attempt. Oh! He's in big, big trouble. Oh, he might be out. Oh! Beautiful right hook. Big straight punch. Really 
really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Oh, he oh, got hurt! This could be it! Now goes in and secures the takedown. He's back in the full guard now. Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Changing up his level, goes with the elbow to the body. Real good ground and pound here by Faber. And he's back in the guard. In the full guard here. Oh, shades of Kenny Florian there. Elbow from the bottom by T-City, Brian Ortega. Faber gets up and decides to take this fight back to its feet, despite having a seemingly dominant position on the ground. Well, if that's not the best jab in the game, it's right up there, continuing to land and keep his opponent at distance. How about that chin? Ortega's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area. Oh! oh! He's got him hurt here. 30 seconds to go. Full guard here. in mission control here. Back to full guard again. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Beautiful strike here, lands on target. And here a perfectly placed punch results in a knockdown. And here's a devastating punch that results in a knockdown. Here we go, let's go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's Third go. round underway. Good defense to block the wow. strike coming down. Oh! This could be it right here. Stance now, Joe. Wow! They were looking to capitalize. Oh! Wow! Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. And there's one leg over. He's almost mounted him here. He's got it. He's mounted him. Reversed. And he executed a very nice sweep here and wound up in guard. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. T City gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh, full mount. Ortega gets caught with that punch. This is fighting. And that's going to do it. Tremendous TKO. Great stoppage by the referee. Yeah, Joe, how's that for a flurry to end this fight here tonight? It was the one big strike that was the beginning of the end. Got the knockdown and then created the opening that allowed it. We go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is calling to stop to this contest at two minutes, 43 seconds of the third round. He played the winner by TKO, the California Kid, Uriah Faber. All right, so the Cali Kid, Uriah Faber.